Bear Tattoo here. Well, I didn't uh, give my analysis of the game last week because I was too depressed after watching that shit show that the Bears put on. That was, that was a failure in every phase of the game. The offense, the defense, and special teams. It was probably the worst game of the year against probably one of the worst teams in the NFL. It was just so depressing, I couldn't even bring myself to doing a video. So we're moving on. Uh, we're going to play the Redskins tomorrow. Another game that the Bears should be able to win, but anymore, I don't know whether they who's going to show up and who isn't going to show up. So tomorrow, uh, Marty Bennett isn't going to play. I'm assuming that Alshon will. Uh, I'm hearing that uh, McPhee isn't going to play on the defensive side. Uh, Kevin White's done for the season. Marty Bennett's done for the season. So I think the Bears are done for the season. So uh, it's still a game they should be able to win. I know these guys will show up and they'll do their best. But uh, I don't know. Uh, they're going to play the Redskins, Kirk Cousins. I just, you know, I just don't think he's a very good quarterback. But shit, I didn't think Blaine Gabbert was a good quarterback either, and he made the Bears look like a bunch of numbskulls. But anyway, so we got Kurt Cousins tomorrow. Uh, we'll just have to see what happens. I'm still hopeful that the Bears can find a way to win and stay in this thing. Uh, they can win out. They can still have a winning record. Uh, you know, what's really disheartening is Green Bay's losing, the Vikings are losing. I mean, if they'd have won some of these close games, they'd be leading the division right now. So that's what's so damn frustrating about these guys. But uh, we'll see what happens. Predicting a win. Talk to you later.